Hi everyone, we are at FF Trio. We would like to introduce to you Jiro Data Express. You might be wondering what Jiro Data Express is. Well, as a start, Jiro Data Express comes from the word gerontology, statistical data, and express. So we simplify it as Jiro Data Express. The gerontology is a study of aging processes and individuals across the life course. So among the things that gerontologists do is that they study the physical, mental, and social changes in people as they age. They investigate the changes in society resulting from our aging population and utilizes the application of this knowledge to policies and programs. Gerontologists improve the quality of life and promote the well-being of people as they age through research, education, practice and the application of interdisciplinary knowledge of the aging process and aging population. Next is the statistical data. We utilize open data source such as Institute of Labor Market Information and Analysis, the LMI Open Data Platform, Statistic Data Warehouse from the Department of Statistics Malaysia, and Data Tribuka Malaysia to get in data and information on aging population in Malaysia. All the information you need is just a single click easy to access with vast information, so that's why we call it Express. Thus, your data Express is a web application, some sort of one-stop center which collects information on aging population, specifically on labor market characteristics on aging population in Malaysia. As Malaysia is becoming an aging nation in 2030, it is important that we understand the driving forces of aging population which is affecting the pattern of the future labor market. That this Gero Data Express provides data regarding older people aged 60 years and above. Data is important because from the data analysis, we are able to understand better the problem and making informed decision from further analysis, research, and study. We characterize the data on aging population into four characteristics. First is demography, which includes data on fertility, mortality, and life expectancy. These data would give information of the current status and indicators of our aging population in Malaysia. Second is labor market, which gives information on older people's employment, whether they are employed, unemployed, or out of labor market. It is important to ensure that older people's participation are not being isolated in the country's development agenda. Third is human capital, which specifies the information on education status, lifelong learning, as well as migration. These data are useful to ensure older people's productivity in the labor market. And finally, the social economic characteristic where data provided are those related to income, social security, and poverty status. All this information is essential to ensure older people's economic in independence in later life. Thus, all these data are very useful and significant among all levels of society, whether you are policymakers, academia, researchers, students, government agencies, or anyone interested in the issues of population aging. Thanks to Institute of Labor Market Information and Analysis, ILMIA, and the Department of Statistics Malaysia for providing all these useful data to make our future labor market better.